Welcome, and good evening, to the first episode of A Watery Hobo, The Life Thereof, starring yours truly, Captain B.V. We'll be starting the evening with a glass of Triada Vintage 2012 from Argentina. We'll be starting our journey in the forward stateroom, also known as the V-Berth, the cruise quarters, the gel room, the sheets forever stained. Entering the forward berthing, this is where I stash my clean laundry, my paperwork, and whatever other shit I don't want to see on a daily basis. It's not all depressing in here, really. There's art for our guests to enjoy, a dungeon for things to crawl out of, and access to my under. Exiting the room of filth, to your starboard and the ship's port, you have the ship's head. We've upgraded from the Folgers can I used to piss in, as well as marble countertops, a full shower that doubles as my dirty hamper. As you exit the head, you run into one of three standing closets where, surprisingly, my hobo clothes like to hang to avoid all the moths. And then we enter the main saloon. The dining area, the couch, the galley. This just so happens to be my favorite nap spot. Here we have what appears to be a couch, which then doubles into quite a nice sea birthing, which turns into my favorite place to nap while I watch the television that I disconnected myself. You see over here, this is the dining area. Rule one to a wooden ship always use coasters. Rule number two, never dirty a glass. Hanging just above the dolphins, I have my Weems and Plath barometer and clock. And to the port side, I keep all my rich leather-bound books. We enter the galley with double stainless steel sinks, six cubic feet of refrigeration, and an oscillating stove. Starboard of the galley, we have the navigation station. We have the master control board, navigation instruments, radio. Also, where I like to hide my smoke. Now, the final stop on our tour is a moment you've all been waiting for. Where does the magic happen? The stabbing cabin. The creepy quarters. Where is it? And normally, I'd say, well, you're just going to have to come see for yourself, Dave. But let's face it, none of y'all go on to take that risk. So I'm just going to show you. We're now entering the magic room, right over here, we have a full size bed, not made because that's a waste of time, more leather bound books in the corner, we have beautiful renderings from unknown Spanish artists, we have my favorite pull out sink, as well as additional storage and another berthing, this is actually a bed where I put things that I don't know where else to put them. Well, I hope you kids enjoyed the tour. If it looked dark in here, it's because it is. It's a fucking sailboat. And if you're scared of coming in, don't worry. I'll wash the floors. Now, guests are welcome anytime, though females are bad luck, so they all have to sleep in bed with me so as not to bring voodoo to the rest of the crew. Sailing charters are available as long as called in advance of up to one hour, and cancellations on my behalf are non-refundable. Well, thanks for joining me. I'll see you guys next time for another episode of The Watery Hobo. Have a good night.